Hello everyone, this is Vijay and welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we will discuss how to find eigenvalues and eigenvectors of square matrix in a simple way. By using this trick, we can find the eigenvalues and eigenvectors of any square matrix of order 3 by 3. So before going to the today's session, subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me in Telegram for more updates. Now let's have a look into the today's session. The question what is given? Find the eigenvalues and eigenvectors. Find the eigenvalues and eigenvectors of matrix A. And the entries of the matrix A are 8, minus 6, 2, minus 6, 7, minus 4, 2, minus 4, 3. These are the entries of the square matrix A. And it is a 3 by 3 matrix. And it is a 3 by 3 square matrix. Here we have to find the eigenvalues by using characteristic equation. To find the characteristic equation, what we required here? Characteristic polynomial. What is the characteristic polynomial? A minus lambda i. So first to find the characteristic polynomial 8 minus 6 2 minus 6 7 minus 4 2 minus 4 3 these are the entries of the square matrix A minus lambda is a scalar next to I means identity matrix 3 by 3 identity matrix 1 0 0 0 1 0 0 0 1 okay next to here subtraction of these two matrices what it gives 8 minus lambda lambda into 1 lambda lambda into 0 0 lambda into 0 so subtraction of these two matrix what did you give 8 minus lambda minus 6 2 okay next minus 6 here 7 minus lambda 7 minus lambda next to minus 4 next here 2 minus 4 3 minus lambda 3 minus so it is a a minus lambda i so square matrix a minus lambda i from this what we find characteristic polynomial to find the characteristic polynomial what we required here determinant of a minus lambda i to find the determinant of the square matrix what do we get here characteristic polynomial if this value is equals to zero then it is a characteristic equation from this characteristic equation what we find here we find the eigenvalues we find the eigenvalues of the square matrix a current just now the first two a minus lambda i and square matrix find out just now. A minus lambda i. E A minus lambda i determine to find out just the characteristic polynomial. A determinant value equal to 0 is the characteristic equation. So, characteristic equation is the characteristic equation. So, that means we have find out just now. Eigenvalues find out just now. Here it is a 3 by 3 matrix. It is a 3 by 3 matrix. So, what do we get here? Third degree characteristic equation. What do we get here? Third degree characteristic equation. If the matrix is 2 by 2, we get second degree characteristic equation. It takes too much time to solve the eigenvalues of the square matrix. Okay, it's standard method of solve just here. What we take here? It takes too much time to solve the eigenvalues. Here, given matrix is 3 by 3 matrix. So, the characteristic equation is a third degree equation. Lambda Q minus. Here, what do we write? Next term is sum of the entries of diagonal. What are the entries of the diagonal? 8, 7, 3. So it is a diagonal and the entries of the diagonal are 8, 7, 3. Add this value 7 plus 3, 10. 10 plus 8, 18. 18 into lambda square plus. Next to what we write here, we take the three sub matrices. Here we, what we take here, we take three sub matrices and find the determinant of those three sub matrices. Then we get the coefficient of lambda value. Here first I am taking one of the sub matrices that is 8 minus 6 minus 6, 7. Okay, 8 minus 6 minus 6 7. So what we take here from 3 by 3 we take 2 by 2 sub matrices. So find the determinant here 56 minus 36. What we get here 2. Days. So this is the determinant of this 2 by 2 matrix. Let's take the another 2 by 2 matrix 7 minus 4 minus 4 3. Okay. You can select any 2 by 2 matrix. 7 minus 4 minus 4 3. So 7 3 is a 21. 4 4 is a 16. Minus 8 minus plus 21 minus 16. So what is the value here? 5. Okay, next one is hmm. we are taking the last entries of the square matrix. What are the entries? Last entries 8, 2, 2, 3. So 8, 2, 2, 3. Find the determinant of this the sub matrix. Find the determinant of the sub matrix. 8 3 is a 24, 24 minus 4. 20. Okay, now add all these values 20 plus 5 plus 20. What do we get here? 45. So 45 into lambda. To find the coefficient of lambda value, here we are selecting three different two by two sub matrices, and we find the 
determinant of those sub matrices and odd all values what we get here coefficient of lambda so 3 by 3 matrix nunchi manam em chestunnam ante sub matrices find out chestunnam order of 2 by 2 three sub different sub matrices teeskuntunnam video ko determine find out chesi vatini add chesthe manaki coefficient of lambda vastundi next one is minus of determinant of the square matrix determinant of given square matrix deeni oka determinant ento ento ostunnaru ani direct rasnanu zero okay deeni oka determinant find out chesthe manaki ento ostundi zero ostundi so i am writing here zero so which is equals to zero so it is a characteristic equation no need to solve the a minus lambda i ikkada a minus lambda i chesi deeni determinant find out chesi take too much time here we are solving using shortcut trick here we find the characteristic equation by using shortcut trick okay here lambda cube minus here 18 is a sum of the entries of diagonal plus 45 is a sum of the determinant of sub matrices of the matrix a and 0 is a determinant of the matrix which is equals to 0 from this we find the lambda value so lambda cube minus 18 lambda square plus 45 lambda equal to 0 if you take the lambda comma what we get lambda square minus 15 lambda plus 45 equals to 0 splitting into linear factors what do we get lambda minus 15 lambda minus 3 equals to 0 here the eigen values are lambda equal to 0 3 15 these three are the eigen values these are the eigen values of the square matrix a see shortcut trick was simple how this so ala ga gonna be just on the matrix you could determine to find out chasing well equal to 0 just like money same equation of some same characteristic equation on a was to me now we find the eigen vectors corresponding to the eigen values 0 3 and 15 now when I am taking lambda equal to 0, we find the eigenvector corresponding to the eigenvalue lambda equal to 0. To find the eigenvector, what we require here? A minus lambda i into x is equal to 0. What we require here? We require square matrix A minus lambda i and x is the eigenvector which is equal to 0. Here we have to find the value of x. Okay, what is the value of square matrix A minus lambda i? 8 minus lambda minus 6 to minus 6, 7 minus lambda minus 4, minus 4, 3 minus lambda. Here, substitute lambda equal to 0 here, what do we get? 8 minus 0, 8, 8 minus 6, 2, okay, next minus 6, 7 minus 0, 7, minus 6, 7, minus 4, next 2, minus 4, 3 minus 0, 3 into, here the 3 by 3 matrix, so write the 3 values, x1, x2, x3, which is equals to 0, 0, 0. Here we find the eigenvectors using simple trick. Here we find the eigenvectors of the square matrix by using one of the simple trick. Let's see this one. See here x1 by here we omit the first column and first row and write the remaining values of the matrix. 7 minus 4 minus 4 3 which is equals to x2 by here second column and first row. Leave the values of the second column and first row. What we get? Minus 6, minus 4, 2, 3. Here I take the minus for x2. x3 by x2. Omit the third column and first row. Write the remaining values. Minus 6, 7, 2, minus 4. Here we have to find the determinant of these sub matrices. x1 by determinant of this matrix is 7, 3 is a 21, 21. 4, 4 is a 16, 16, 21 minus 16, what do we get here? 5, okay, minus of x2 by minus 6, 3, okay. minus 6 into 3, 18, minus 18, uh, 2, what do we get here? Minus 10, okay. next x3 by determinant of this matrix is minus 6 into minus 4, minus uh, 24, 24 minus 14, Sorry. value is 10, here what we take equals to some constant, okay. Yes, minus minus cancel 5 1 5 2 5 2 so x1 by 1 x2 by 2 x3 by 2 which is equals to k from this what we write x1 x2 x3 eigenvector x1 x2 x3 is equal to what we get here x1 into k 1 into k k 2 into k 2k 2 into k 2k we take the k common so 1 2 2 here 
1, 2, 2 is the eigenvector corresponding to the eigenvalue lambda equals to 0. Similarly, we find the eigenvector corresponding to the eigenvalue lambda equal to 3 and 15. Next one, if you take lambda equals to 3, if you take lambda equals to 3 is an eigenvalue and substitute lambda equals to 3 in square matrix A minus lambda i. Here what we are taking, we are taking eigenvalue lambda equal to 3 and if substitute lambda equal to 3 in square matrix A minus lambda i, what we get here? This is the value of a minus lambda i, a minus lambda i into x equals to 0. By using this, we find the eigenvectors. Here what are the entries of a minus lambda i? 5, minus 6, 2, minus 6, 4, minus 4, 2, minus 4, 0. Now, to find the x value, here I am selecting submatrices. So, x1 by leave the first column and first row entries, write the remaining terms, 4, minus 4, minus 4, 0, minus x2 by second row first column, sorry, second column, first row, what we get, minus 6, minus 4, 2, 0, equals to x3, by last column, first row, minus 6, 4, 2, minus 4, find the determinant of these submatrices, what we get, x1 by minus 16, minus x2 by 8, which is equals to x3 by 16, these are the determinant of these three submatrices, now, 8 ones are 8, 8 twos are 8 twos are, so values are, x1 by minus 2, equals to x2 by minus 1 which is equals to x3 by 2 equal to write some constant k from this x1 x2 x3 equal to what we get x1 equal to minus 2 into k x2 equal to minus 1 into k x3 is equal to 2 into k if you take the k common minus 2 minus 1 2 so this is the eigenvector corresponding to the eigenvalue lambda equals to 3 next is the last one lambda equal to 15 next is what we take here lambda equal to 15 is an eigenvalue you have to find the eigenvector corresponding to the eigenvalue lambda equal to 15 if substitute lambda equal to 15 in square matrix a minus lambda i, here I am writing directly the value of a minus lambda i is minus, minus 7 minus 6 2, minus 7 minus 6 2, minus 6 minus 8 minus 14 2, minus 4 minus 12. This is the value of a minus lambda i. If substitute lambda equal to 15 in matrix a minus lambda i, what we get here? The square matrix minus 7 minus 6 2 minus 6, minus 8, minus 4, 2, minus 4, minus 2. These are the entries of the square matrix a minus lambda i into x1, x2, x3 which is equal to 0, 0, 0. Here we write the submatrices of the square matrix x1. Here leave the first column and first row remaining terms minus 8, minus 4, minus 4, minus 2. Next to second column first row minus x2 by minus 6, minus 4, 2, minus 2. Next which is equal to x3 by leave the elements of third column and first row minus 6, minus 8, 2, minus 4. If you find the determinant of these submatrices, what we get? x1 by 80, which is equal to minus x2 by 80, which is equal to x3 by 40. Now, 40 ones of 40, 42 is 80, 42 is 80, cancel values, x1 by 2, x2 by 2, x3 by 1. Here, what we take here, these values are equal to some constant k. So, from this, x1 is equal to 2k, x2 equal to 2k, x3 is equal to take, x3 is equal to k, if you take the k common, 2, 2, 1. This is the eigenvector corresponding to the eigenvalue lambda equals to 15. In this simple way, we find the eigenvalues and eigenvectors of the square matrices. Thank you.